Hello, I'm Jeremy Mansfield. This is my first video that I'm creating out there. Um, I hope this won't be so boring because um, it's just going to be me giving a vlog, most likely, because I'm new to this. Um, I just wanted to create a video because why not? We're in quarantine. It's kind of it's kind of like boring of doing the same routine of uh, absolutely got to do my homework. So I'm in college. Um, and playing video games, watching YouTube, and just why not try something new? Um, so this is, will be my first YouTube video coming out, and um, my family's been quarantined throughout this whole entire time, and we're trying to stay safe and healthy as best as we can. So hopefully you're staying safe and healthy too as well while being out there because there's so many cases of this uh, coronavirus, and um, hospitals are taking their time of treating the patients and doing the best they can to isolate people and tell people to isolate themselves and the CDC website and the government and everything. Um, just hopefully you're staying safe, staying um, healthy, and also staying positive because like me and you, we all know this is going on for too long. It's been like a month, feels like a month and a half, feels like two. Um, we're kind of just stuck inside and just blowing our minds with all this information going out there and it's just crazy like um for me it just it doesn't really feel that long because obviously like you're stuck at home there's no new scenery there's no going out and um going grocery like even like stuff like grocery shopping because like you could have a set routine of going grocery shopping like maybe once a week or um, whatever, or just like whatever daily routine, like even going to work. Um, Cause I'm like every other weekend I work at a grocery store. And so like having not being able to go to work and stuff, like it just feels like you're just stuck in this um, trans of I'm stuck at home. I can't go anywhere. I don't have a daily routine. I can't go to school cause school is closed. I can't work at the grocery store because my family is just wanting us to quarantine and just stay safe out of this whole situation. And also like other hobbies, like I play Magic the Gathering. And so since they banned gatherings that are 10 or more people and all these uh, non-essential stores, such as game stores or wherever, um, you could be able to play Magic the Gathering are now closed. And so I can't do that every Friday night and all these small other businesses are also closed. And so um, it kind of sucks with that, but like overall in general, if this were life were to continue, it would get a lot worse. And a lot of people would probably regret it too, because like you're also putting your health at risk and you're putting others at risk. And then you may feel bad because like with people that have these issues and then they end up dying which obviously sucks but in reality it's just a way of how us humans live and how we work and how our bodies are so you really can't control that but what you can control is doing these safety measures and doing the best that way you can be and also trying to stay positive because a lot of youtubers are trying to create content and stuff like that for us to watch because I've been trying to watch all of them and it's been crazy how um, quick they've been uh, giving videos. Um, so I bravo to them. I bravo to obviously the medical people um, who've been trying to keep everybody safe and everything and just people in general who are trying to work their butts off that really want to stay home like essential workers and stuff like that. But beyond that, um, I've been watching a lot of YouTube um, and a lot of YouTubers that I'll give a plug out to is Tristan Jazz. He's a really, he's a really good one. He's enthusiastic. He's given overall of like his life and also trying to stay positive. He had a video of reaching to NBA players of being positive, and I thought that was a really cool one. Um, the two hype people, um, people I may forget, but it's like Mopey, Jesser, um, Chris, Zach, Jidel known as James, and like TD, um, Mal, and uh, Cash, and other people that may go into it too as well that are not like directly into hype, but they are around them, but obviously they can't go to them because of this quarantine and they live in a different state. 
Um, also, like, Trevor Martin is a good person, too. He does, like, uh, gaming of all, whether it be shooting games, whether it be sports, whether it be, like, racing, all that stuff. I have also watched, like, Troy Dan, because he likes to have live streams and all that stuff and really get with the um, viewers and subscribers um, and all that stuff. So kudos to all those guys. And I've watched others on um, too, but not as much. But it's really crazy to see the turnout of what they're doing is posting like every other day or every day or what they're trying to do is so fun especially uh going back even though i missed the live stream of uh them hitting the a million subscribers on their two hype channel which is great i kudos to them they've busted their butt and done everything um besides that like um a lot of other things like video games i like to play um action like warzone that came out i like to play that a couple of times like obviously i'm not the greatest i may even do a live stream if i can i'm not really updated on the uh, technology or whatnot like because this is my first video so i'll have hiccups and um i don't have like what other youtubers have i don't have like the microphone the cameras and whatnot but i'll be trying to get to all that stuff because why not try something new and if I have time for it, create a video, create a live stream, why not? Um, especially if I have the time to do it. And this is a great way to take time out of my hands and be like, yo, I can create video content for fun. And so, um, yeah. And also leave in the comments down below if you have any suggestions of what you would want to see from me, like I may do video games like WWE, NBA, uh, MLB, like 18. So I may not have the latest games. Um, like I have Madden 19, I don't have Madden 20. I have NBA 20, I have NASCAR Heat 4, and I have like other games too as well. Um, and also like Fortnite, Warzone and stuff like that. So I may not have like the latest game of like what's out there. But I can still have fun with the games that I have and create content based off of that. So, if you want to leave a comment down below and see what you'd want to see or what you, what kind of live stream. And also subscribe down below if you feel free. Um, obviously, I may not be the best and that may not be your cup of tea. So, if you don't subscribe, I'm not going to be hurt. But it's just something new. Why not? And also about me, um, I like to play Magic the Gathering. So, like... Um, the card game, and there's also MTG Arena, which is more um, what they're trying to promote now with this quarantine and having game stores um, have a code and that every Friday night that you could play Magic, connect this games, game store code, and then they'll give you like a reward of something. Um, which is nice. Obviously, I don't really play Magic Arena all that much, to be honest, but I like the game overall. I'll play it every once in a while. It's just, I prefer paper, but obviously with the gatherings and whatnot, and my family doesn't really play Magic the Gathering. It's only like me, and I have like friends like outside, but with this time or whatnot, like I'm not going to go outside and like risk my life for it. And it's really just kind of weird of doing a video FaceTime. Obviously, some people do that. Like, they FaceTime and play Magic the Gathering with each other, which is cool. Like, it's a fun, it's a new way of playing Magic the Gathering. But overall, in general, you don't really have the authentic experience if you're not person to person. And with all the creatures and all that stuff. And the new the new set, Akora, or whatever it's called, is coming out soon within a week or if few days like this coming up weekend that this uh the set is already on arena but like paper what it came out like coming up like this coming up weekend and so it would have been cool to have that happen but obviously with this quarantine it won't but eventually everything will get back to what it was even though it won't get 
it won't be the same because like some businesses won't be able to open with the financial needs that they have but overall in general the government and everybody's trying to get everything back try to get it back to normal as quick as possible but also have to, to have the safety of others and so that's cool and it's also nice to know that they're trying their best but who knows at this point like it could be three weeks from now it could be two months from now who knows but for my positivity i'm just trying to cherish every single day that we have together as a with my family and stuff and try to stay as much positive as i can obviously it's kind of mentally draining right now because you've been in your house for a month um and you can't really do anything but overall it's the best thing we can do right now and the only thing you can do is try to try to do something that makes you happy try to um play games if you need to to make happy um try to create an exercise workout in your house somewhere if you can and just to be the best that you can be and talk to others and reach out to others facetime others uh, call or text or whatever you need to do in order to um, be positive and go through this as we all are um, another positive thing about it that i've been seeing is that yeah okay the sports seasons haven't like continued because obviously with the nba and the g league has been shut down um, i've really enjoyed the because i live in wisconsin so i have the wisconsin herd games but obviously um we can't go to those because with the suspension and everything um that uh sports um have been like been creative of implying video games as their like outlet and seeing like who could be the better player or like um they did the game of horse and so like they had two players obviously in their separate locations um videoed live um through the technology we have and copy it, the shot to the best of their ability with the angles and whatnot and create that i haven't seen like the winner because i only saw a short snippets unless if it's like a weekly thing i haven't seen it so if you can update me in the comments down below that would be nice and also uh the mlb did um did one representative baseball player within the league and they were representing their own team and they created a tournament that way i haven't been watching that i knew it was on twitch but if someone can uh let me know down below that would be nice too um yeah feel free to like this video subscribe i don't know how this will go um, whether it'll be a very good one or whether it won't be because it'll be kind of just like boring of me talking but some people like that some people don't i may you know add some things here and there but who knows eventually down the road i'll get better at it maybe create more videos maybe not who knows depending on like how this quarantine goes and since i have extra time on my hands like why not create a video and so here i am with this video and hopefully you're staying positive, staying safe, and staying healthy. Peace out.